does things and great big things. And we think, well, I haven't done any big things, you know. Um, might have, um, well, might have said one or two things about the mother-in-law, but who hasn't, you know. Then there's the others, you, you know, a little bit bigger things, saying you didn't do something when you know jolly well you did. Then, of course, there are the massive, big, enormous things, you know, the kind of thing, parking on double yellow lines, all that kind of thing. And uh, we tend to divide sin up because we think we can get round it that way. However, God doesn't see sin like us either. He doesn't see some little sins and some medium-sized sins and some big sins. No, he sees all sins the same. Because it is, you see, and it all needs dealing with the same way. It's no good just trying to be good. Because I tried that starting when I was a tiny little kid. And it might have lasted for ten minutes or an hour, you know. But the thing is that uh, God says, don't divide sins up into different categories. They're all the same as far as he's concerned. And there's only one person that can put them right and change them. And that's the Lord Jesus who died for us. Uh, 